Good morning to everyone. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is Natural Escapes Collector's Edition for the Nintendo Switch. This game, this game's about proudly sponsored by and supplied to me by the amazing people at Ocean Media Games. Ocean Media, check them out, guys. If you're watching me live right now on my Twitch channel, I want to say hi. How you doing? Thank you for watching. Thank you for taking the time out to call past my live stream. But if you couldn't make it to today's live stream and you're watching me back on my YouTube channel as a video replay, I just want to say thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, guys, it's not necessary. It's never asked for. Hey, I probably wouldn't do it if I was in your shoes either. But for some crazy idea, reason, or idea, what do you want to do? If you want to like my videos for some reason or subscribe to my channel or even follow me, I just want to say thank you in advance. You mean the world to me. I really, really do appreciate it. Thank you. Now, let me tell you what this game's about before we just dive in and start playing it. Natural Escapes Collector Edition. Get ready to uh, get lost in the beautiful, uh, wild beauty of naturals with a hidden object game. Each jaw-dropping stop of your journey features beautiful detailed scenery, dozens of hidden objects to find, and a variety of challenging mini-games. You'll learn fascinating plants, plant facts, and collect exotic plants along the way to use while you design and decorate your own very, very own garden. So pick up a trowel and test your green thumb in this refreshing new hidden object puzzle game. So the game features six captivating bonus chapters to explore, set the scene with 11 music tracks straight from the game's score, and customize your garden with exclusive plants and flowers. Uh, this game was released on January 26, 2023, so it's available right now on the Nintendo eShop. Go pick it up, guys. It's a single-player game. Uh, the gene is an adventure puzzle. Once again, the publisher, Ocean Media. Uh, the game file size for the Nintendo Switch is 1.2 gigabytes. Supported language is English. Okay, I don't need to say anything else, I don't think. No, I don't. So let's get straight into it. Now, if you ever watched me play one of these games before, you'll know... We use a cursor. I don't know if you can see the cursor on the screen right now. It's kind of hard to see because the background's taken away. But the left cursor, left stick moves the cursor this fast, and the right moves it this fast. So the right's are a tad slower. Let's check out their um, collector's decision. So we've got bonus chapters in the CE, uh, also plants, and also different music as well. Uh, options. We can do the music volume. See if we can adjust it. Oh, the option may only be changed outside of the gameplay. Okay. While we're here, let's check out the credits. Once again, publisher Ocean Media. Developer, Tiny Little Lion. Big shout out to them. Okay, let's close that up. Let's, what else we need to see? We've got my garden here. Uh, please finish the tutorial first. Don't need to play a tutorial. Seriously, I know how to play the game. Played many of these games. So there's a cursor now. Let's see how fast it goes. It's hard to see in the background now, but you can see how fast it's going with the right stick, and this is the left stick, so much faster. Find all the hidden uh, paraloids. So we can go, let's just, if we can get on there. Okay, so we got that one. Uh, Polaroids are converted to coins, spendable on plants in my garden menu. Pay attention to objects that shape shift. These are called morphing objects. Found morphing objects are covered and converted to flowers you can plant in the wild from the natural album menu. We're going to click on that thing there. So it's kind of hard to... You're going to get used to the controllers, guys, because they're very uh, sensitive. Some hidden objects can be found in the sparkling arena. So we go here. Find objects consecutively to maintain a high score combo and earn a higher score. Activate the magnifying glass via through its button or on the bottom right of the ZR button. Okay, so we've got a magnifying glass. Let's check that out straight away. ZR. We can actually zoom in. So we've played a lot of Ocean Media games, or what these type of games, and they some some of them don't have um, a zoom in. Some do. So it's always handy to have a zoom because with these type of games, it's very cluttered. It's very very vivid, very colourful. It's kind of hard to find everything. So 
We are looking for bananas. We're looking for an otter. A uh, snowflake seems to be grayed out at the moment. A watering can, a tribal mask, an owl. Uh, a spade is grayed out, a gecko, and a sh cherub. So, let's get into it right now. We can find a... There's a little garden gnome there. Can't click him. There's a key. This is unzoom at the moment. Let's have a look what we can find. Let's see if we can find anything. We found like a... Was that an otter there? I don't know what that is. That's not nothing. It's a pot plant. It's like a porcupine there. Okay, so we're looking for bananas. I think this banana is just here. Okay, bananas. 850 points. Which is good. Now, this game's not timed, which is great. Because we can take our time with it. We can just sit back and enjoy it and relax and play these type of games. They're really, really great for relaxation. Uh, watering can, tribal mask, owl, gecko, and... Cherub. There's also hints, which is Y. Super hint is X. And let's click this real quick. Watering can. Looking for a watering can. Snowflake. So the things that appear in this section have been ungrayed. So airplane, snowflake, and spade are in this section. A little bit different to the other um, other puzzle games or find seek and find games that we've been played before. So we can zoom in. That's a spade there, isn't it? So not a spade as a digging spade. I can't even click on that. It's a uh, spade as the symbol card spade. Uh, crystals. We're looking for crystals, airplane, and snowflake. Let's unzoom. Might be easier. Snowflake, snowflake. So here's a snowflake at the top. Oh, uh, we got a camera. We'll just get find a little pineapple down here. We'll remember that just in case the camera's here. Ah, uh, candles, crystals, airplane, candle. Nice and vivid colours in this game. Looks looks really really good. All enjoying it, relaxing. Soundtracks in the background. It's kind of a nice relaxing soundtrack. Not too loud. We haven't really turned it up. But it's, even if it was loud, I don't think it'd be a bad one. It's an elephant. Looking for crystals, a candle. There's a crystal. If I can click on it. As I said, you just got to get used to the uh, controllers because they are pretty sensitive. Just one of those things. If I could change one thing, I'd make sure there's a candles. I'd change the slow stick to the left stick and I'd make it a lot slower than it really is. But that's just me. Airplane and bamboo. We saw the bamboo a second ago, didn't we? It's not bamboo. Is that bamboo? No, it's not. So obviously it's got to be... What are you looking for? Airplane. I haven't seen the airplane. I've seen the army men. I haven't seen him before. Sun zoom. Looking for the... Oh, the bamboo's here. Oh, I've got to get right on it, do I? There we go. And now the airplane, which I think would be... If I'm going to guess, I'm going to guess it's around here. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we've got all this out. We don't have to go in there anymore. So now we're looking for a rabbit, otter, acorns, watering can, tribal musk, owl, arrow, gecko, and cherub. Okay, watering cans here. So normally when we collect one, um, okay, feather, a new one's appeared, which is in this section here. So let's see what how many we can find on this section first, and we'll go back to this section and try to find the feather. Okay, arrow, tribal mask, tribal mask is here, if we can click on it, sorry. Once again guys, if you're watching me live right now, uh, feel free to chime in. If I can't see something, and for instance, you can see, say, the rabbit. You can say, hey Marbs, uh, rabbit's in the top left hand corner. So it just gets me around that area to look. I know it's pretty hard to actually point at exactly where it is, but just say those simple things and It'll point me in the right direction. And I'll give you all the credit. Well, at least some of it. 35%. Rabbit, otter, otter. There's the rabbit. Now, is that the otter? Yeah, it's not an otter. Okay, so that's... There's the otter there. 
an owl, there's a Buddha. I don't know what that looks like, a shark or, yeah, some sort of shark fish kind of thing. There's a crab. I just saw something then. Where is it? They're in the front here. What is that? I can't even, it's so. Okay, so we've got that, so we got the gecko. Cherub. Where is a cherub? What's this thing here? I don't know what that is. There's a wrench. Do we need to find the wrench? Acon's arrow. Dice. Found some dice. Get rid of that real quick so we can see what's this here. There we go. Found the cherub. Ow. It's a bear. Ours is hidden here. Just, yep, it's just so. Uh, Acon's. An arrow. That's what we've got to find. Then we've got to go back and find the feather inside the little... Let's do that now. Let's go back and find the feather real quick. Okay, so once again, if you can find the feather, point it out. Get rid of that. There's the feather right there. Okay, so we can get out, go back in. Acon's an arrow. Okay, Okay, looking for him, looking for him, looking for him. Sundial. Uh, Jericho says, arrow is on the floor right side. Floor right side. Oh, there. I was looking for like a, a bow and arrow kind of thing. That's what I was looking for, but it's an arrow as in an arrow. Pointing arrow. Acons, what's that? Ice cream? I wanna know what that is. <laughs> I still think it's a shark. Oh, that is. Acons, I can't see them anywhere. Some sort of lizard there, hold on, what's that there? There we go. Thank you for helping me out there, Jericho. Much appreciated. Once again, guys, just do what Jericho did, and then we'll just go around the game. It's easy. Continue on. You can learn about plants as well. Got a bronze star for that. Okay, what do we got here? Don't know. Tap A and hold to drag the color uh, area within the outlines of the color and complete the painting. Okay, so what do, why do we do this? Okay, so tap A and hold, then drag on the uncolored area within the outlines to color and complete the painting. Okay, so I can do this. This could be, take a while actually guys. I don't know how much we have, do we have to do every single part of it to get it nice? Because that could be annoying. Okay, so I think I got it all. And now we can just color that in. <laughs> it's, it's hard to get it all. Okay. Now we're gonna color the leaves in. <laughs> oh man. It's fiddly. These leaves are different colors, obviously. Color the rest of the bird in. Oh man, don't tell me the bird's got more parts to it too. It does. So it's, it's got little mini games in it. It's also, you know, the main the main game's finding things, but it's also got these things to do in the game as well. So it's just not one, not a one hit wonder. It's got heaps of different things. Good replay value. Controllers are really sensitive though. I wish I could do something about that, to be honest. <laughs> I should just try it with the, the slower one. Except the slower one's on the wrong side for me. Okay, so it makes that noise. Probably think it means it's done. I really like to change it. As I said, I like to change the speed up. Change it. Actually, just change these things around. Um, let's color these in. I 
we down them all? Make that noise so I know I've done them all. Okay, so I think I've done them all. Trying to click on that leaf there. Hold the button in at the same time and color. This takes ages, guys. Trust me, it does. Okay, so we're gonna do the rest of the birds. Hopefully this is it then. I really think I've done it all now, eh? I can't see anything. I hope it's not one of those parts if you've missed something, then you just, okay, done it. Okay. Took three minutes to do that. Should give me something. That's three minutes is pretty good. Okay, what's this? Uh, tap A on the pieces to rotate them and complete the next. So we're looking for we're looking for a, like a memory game. No. Oh, wait. What? What am I doing? <laughs> Tap A on the pieces to rotate them and complete the image. Okay, so we're gonna actually rotate these. Okay, so that's that image there I'm looking for. How do I know if it's the... Oh, what the hell? This could be... It's a blank image, so what I'm looking for is... How do I know how it's supposed to go? That's circle, then it comes to this shape here. I don't really know what I'm doing to be honest guys. This is this is way off. I gotta get a hint. Hint. Am I just supposed to I think I might oh I don't know. A bit confused. I'm a bit confused with this one. It hasn't really I don't know. Oh I think we should skip this one. Let's do another hint real quick. Okay, so no more hints for this. I don't really get it to be perfect line. Let's skip it. Continue. Continue again. Sorry guys, I couldn't work that one out. That's a bit... I didn't like that one to be honest. Maybe because I didn't like it was too hard for me. Okay, what's going on here? Grey screen. Okay, not getting anything at the moment. Got a grey screen for some crazy reason. Don't know what's going on. Okay, so go back. Don't know what's going on. And now the, the, oh, the cursor's kind of... Okay, so let's... Can't move the left stick. Okay, my left Joy-Con is frozen. Don't know what's going on there. I can move the right one perfectly fine, but the left one is just not working at all. I just took a picture, that works. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, this location is seen used to combine buttons. Okay, so continue. Can't, let's just go to main menu and start again, I think. Okay, so the left Joy-Con on my controller is dead. So if it works certain parts, it doesn't work at all. Okay, so what we want to do right now, it's a live stream, so we're going to bit stuff with it, to be honest. Um, we'll see if we can... Let's just play it. See if we can... Yeah, it's definitely not working at all. Don't know if it's gone flat. The light's still on it, and I could take a picture, so I'm not too sure. Let's continue with that one. Okay, so it just boots into a grey screen now. Okay, so what I think we need to do is I think we need to restart the game. Okay, what we'll do is restart it. Close, and then restart the game. So hopefully that's going to fix it, because it's just... 
didn't seem to well, have to report that glitch to our ocean media. But yeah, completely just went to a grey screen. I lost all function in the joystick on the left Joy-Con. Um, buttons didn't work either. But the uh, take the picture the camera like screenshot button worked fine. Tiny little loan developer. Hopefully it's hopefully it's working now. Okay, so I'm back working, guys. So I don't know. It's not my controller. It wasn't my Joy Cons. It was the game glitching up on me. So that's a great start. I do apologize. Okay, so let's just randomly press a couple of things. Let's continue that and see if we get a gray screen again. We hopefully don't. Okay, so no, we're not getting a gray screen now. Just a bit of a bug. Hopefully we can iron that out if I report it. Okay. Looking for a pipe, camel, doll, rocket, and pinwheel. Rocket. Pinwheel. Pipe, camel, and doll. So where would a doll be? There's a lot of there's a lot of crap on the ground. Oh, there's a rocket there. Sorry. What did I just do then? Okay, so that's that button there. It goes into that button. Sorry. I'm looking for this. I pressed the wrong button. There's the rocket. So if we change up like this, we're looking for a mantis, shoe print, uh, cherub again, sword, and anteater. Let's get out of that. It's a very, very busy screen. Anteater. Where would the anteater be? We did see an anteater in the last image we played, the first one. There's a snail? We're not looking for a snail. A shoe print, which is here. To be perfectly honest, guys, I've streamed a lot of Ocean Media games, played a lot of them as well. That's the first glitch or bug that I have encountered in all the games. Why disappointing? Uh, that's not a bad, not a bad achievement. Scorpion. Mantis. Pro Mantis, is it? Like a stick insect kind of thing, is it? Not too sure. Sword. Looking for a sword. What's down here? Keys? There's a sword. Mantis, oranges, anteater, and cherub. These things aren't cherubs, are they? Yep, yeah, it is. Okay, mantis. So a mantis. This I'm looking for like a pro mantis. Is that like is that what I'm looking for? So I'm not a hundred percent sure on that one. Eggplant. Oranges, oranges. Oh, there's oranges up here. Why well, it's easy to look at the zoom, 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 but sometimes it's best to go back and then find something, then zoom in on it and see if you're right. Mantis, anti to hummingbird. So the hummingbirds appeared. I'm pretty sure I saw, there it is. Um, mantis, mantis, mantis. Now I could be completely wrong with a mantis. Anteater, where are you, buddy? Is the anteater and a porcupine the same thing, or just they're different? I think they might be different. I'm not too sure. Sank, I might have to ask Dr. Google about if I remember. What's that? Let's look like a snake. Looking for a mantis again. So again, just keep reminding yourself what I'm really looking for. And an anteater, which would blend in pretty damn well. Wow, this is um, this is hard. Okay, let's get out of that. Let's see if we can find these ones: pipe, camel, doll, kangaroo, squirrel, pinwheel, and coral. I found the coral. Um, squirrel, which is looking for a doll as well. Kangaroo, I think that's a kangaroo. Yep, it is. Should know. I'm Australian. Pipe, camel, doll, camel, camel, camel. There's a camel. There, bobcat, plane, chalk, doll, pipes, squirrel, pinwheel, and bobcat. Where's the squirrel? Where's the doll? There's the doll here. Pipe, 
pipe is here, smoking pipe. Chalks here. If we get on it, there we go. Squirrel, pinwheel, and bobcat. Oh, sprung button, sorry. It's one of these things again. Ah, uh, okay. Squirrel, pinwheel, and bobcat. Bobcat. Looks like a dingo, that one. Piggy. I guess a bobcat. Pinwheel and squirrel. Bunny, monkey. Don't know what that is. Pinwheel. Where's the pinwheel? What's that? Ah, oh, what's... Oh, what happened just then? Okay, so that just changed up, didn't it? That's the coral, it was coral, it just it was from... Yeah, that was cool. Right in front of my eyes it changed. There's more coral. Can we click on that? No, we can't. Ah, pinwheel, pinwheel, pinwheel. That's it looks like a crown. And a squirrel. And for the life of me, I can't find the squirrel or the pinwheel. Now let's start at the top and just scrolly, so, slowly scroll across, I should say. Pinwheel there. Ah, uh, squirrel. Where's the squirrel? Is that a squirrel? It's not a squirrel. I don't know what that is. That's okay. We're going across. Can't see anything at the moment. I've gone way too fast for myself there. Goose. Man, I can't. Let's just let's check in here. We're looking for a mantis, a deer. And an anteater still. A deer. Now, did we see the deer before? Okay, got that one. Anteater. So the anteater didn't look like our um, porcupine at all. I thought it was a snake, to be honest, hanging from that, but I was completely wrong. What are we looking for? Mantis and deer. Now the mantis, I could be completely wrong with, but I'm looking for, as in a stick insect kind of thing. That's what I'm looking for. Now, if I'm wrong, tell me right now, guys, because otherwise I'm gonna have all this conversation, looking, all this concentration, trying to look for like a stick insect. Is that it there? That kind of looks like, no, I think it's just a plant because there's another one in the background. A mantis. I'm hoping that a mantis, there it is, a pro mantis. There it is, a stick incident right there. Okay, now we're just looking for that damn squirrel. Where are you, squirrel boy? Is that it? Is it hidden there? I don't know what that is. I think it's just a bit of, you know, flowers all combined. I'm going to click on this thing again because this really throws me what this is. Definitely doesn't work. That's a turtle. No, I can't see it. Screw it. Okay, we'll just start again. Up to the very top and slowly walk, go across, only looking in the magnifying area. Oh, there is a squirrel. How do we miss that before, right? Eh? How do we miss that before? I don't know, but we did. Bronze star again. Not bad. Hopefully the game doesn't freeze up. or well, not freeze up. Go to a grey screen. Hopefully that issue was just a oncer. We're going to colour this in again, but until that, we're not doing that one. Um, that's if we do it, we just colour it in automatically by pressing that button. Because that's a bit of a... It's, it's easy to do, it just takes too much time. I'm not in the mood to do that. I do apologise. Um, what's this? 
Nah, not today, buddy. We're gonna go back to the main menu. Okay there guys, that concludes my stream today of Natural Escapes Collector Edition for the Nintendo Switch. This stream was proudly sponsored by and provided by Ocean Media. Ocean Media Games, check them out. I'd like to thank everyone for calling past the live stream today. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you couldn't make it and you're watching this back on my YouTube channel as a video replay, thank you for watching. It really do means the world to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Make sure you take care of yourselves and ones you love. Don't forget to feed your pets. Say hi to your dog for me. And remember, you're perfect just the way you are. Unless you want to change, then change. Just be you, do you, and you'll be fine. Until next time, this has been Ocean Media Games Presents Natural Escapes Collector's Edition. Thank you for watching, and bye for now. Ta-ta.